Chris Eubanks Sr. was recently asked about his views on his former rival, Nigel Benn, talking about fighting another one of his former rivals, Steve Collins. And then, and not to be disrespectful, in something which is almost like an OAP fight. Both men in their 50s. Now, this was Chris Eubanks Sr.'s response. He said, What are my thoughts? My thoughts are as follows. Nigel Benn, there's only one fight the public want to see. So he can get on with what he's doing while I train and re-engineer the structure so that I could tear him a new one. <laughs> Sorry, I just put, I had to interject a laugh there, P. I couldn't help it. <laughs> Eubank Senior is a Marmite character. You either love him or hate him. You either love his theatrics or you hate them. Personally, I'm a big fan of the theatrics. I can't say I agree with everything the Eubank Juniors do in terms of the way they conduct their business in boxing, picking <clears throat> juniors' fights and not taking certain fights and all, all that kind of stuff. But in terms of the theatrics, I'm a huge fan of the theatrics, not only of the Eubanks, of many fighters out there who come with theatrics. So anyway, to continue this quote from Eubank, uh, he also talks about, well, he's he's asked about is he open to facing the potential winner of the Nigel Ben steve Collins fight? And he said, let's see what happens. We'll see. As I said about Conor McGregor, you can never underestimate an Irish man ever. Forget McGregor, the man is Irish and that is the problem for Mayweather, but he can't see that. And maybe the most important aspect of the mindset of the elusive obvious, what is so obvious you can't see. Everyone is thinking of him as an MMA fighter, thinking of him as a tough man. You're missing the point. The fighter is Irish, and that is God's wrath at work. <laughs> so those are the words of Chris Eubank Sr. talking about both Nigel Ben versus Steve Collins and also touching on Conor McGregor versus Mayweather. Uh, always entertaining as far as I'm concerned. I love all the theatrics, man. Cracks me up. The stuff he comes out with. And, you know, sometimes... The part that's funniest about Eubank is the fact that he knows he's winding people up. And the fact that people get wound up by the things that he says just makes it all the more funny. <laughs> like he's not someone that is coming out hurling, you know, abuse at people. He's not somebody who's coming out being, uh, you know, racist or, you know, deeply offensive, talking about people's family. Eubank Senior is not doing none of that. What he does say is pretty mild, but the way that he says it seems to wind people up to the point of insanity. I just find that amusing. <laughs> <You know? laughs> so drop your comments in the comment section below, people. Let me know how you felt about it. It's happening, I'm out.